Most people go to a shopping mall to spend money. But for Jess and Paul, today could be an opportunity to earn some instead. In the Together Forever scam. Jess is selling beautifully crafted designer jewelry. These are eternity bracelets, symbols of everlasting friendship. See how easy it is to do it yourself. So obviously, once you've clicked them into place, then they're on for good. Did you just click it into place? Oh, I just pushed it in, but I didn't, you don't, I didn't feel it click. You've just, you just locked it. And there's the catch, quite literally. They're not called eternity bracelets for nothing. No, you're not meant to actually padlock it. You don't take them off once you put them on. It's, <laughs> it's an eternity bracelet. The marks have the bracelets stuck on their wrists, and there are no keys for the padlocks. There's only one thing Jess can suggest. Well, you're going to have to buy this, because I can't resell it. They are £40, but I'll give it to you a lot cheaper because of the situation. I'm going to have to charge you for that. How much was it again? £40. To make an awkward situation even worse, here comes hard-nosed boss, Paul. You all right? Um, this lady's clicked it into place. No, Did you not tell I'll, the lady that no, she's I'll not just, supposed to do that? Oh, please don't. I'm really sorry. I have told you about being clear with people. I'm sorry, but I have. It's for his girlfriend, and I got yeah. a skinny wrist, so we put it on, and then it's well, I'm afraid if you put it on, then it belongs to you. I just have to insist that you pay on it. But I did make it clear that once it's on, it's on. Well, you sort this out. I've told you before to I'll be very clear with don't. people. Now to really ramp up the pressure, Jess turns on the waterworks. Don't get upset. <laughs> Well, I can't afford for people to close them. It says eternity all over it. That's the whole point. So it's coming out of your wages, all right? I'm not paying. Well, if you don't pay, it's coming out of her wages. So the combination of a bowling sales assistant and the bracelet stuck on their wrist leaves most people with little choice but to pay up. Thank you very much. At least they all got a discount. Thank you very much. And they got to keep the bracelet worth all of 80 pence. Would you like a gift box for that? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I felt a bit sorry for her. Her boss was so horrible. She got pretty upset and the manager came and then he was going to dock her wages. Any padlock I've ever bought always comes with a key. It's an item of clothing. I mean, there's no way you would walk around with this on, like, showering, whatnot. This type of scam is very popular all around the world. The victim is put under extreme pressure in public, where the only way out seems to be the handing over of money. Don't feel obliged to pay for something just because someone puts on the waterworks or you've been put under undue pressure. If you don't want to buy something, you're within your rights to just walk away. Who wouldn't like to get some free money? That's the question Jess and Paul would like to find the answer to today. They've come to this suburban office where they'll be making people happy by offering to give them cash. Have you ever heard of that cartoon, Dennis the Menace? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, my God. Um, his nickname is Menace. Yeah? Yeah. Turns out this psychic is more phony than most.